<sighs> I'm getting so many disturbances with you guys' this reading, Virgo. It took me four tries to do Leo. Now this is the second attempt to do you guys' this reading. Oh my gosh, Virgos. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Uh, thank you guys so much for joining TRS Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for all my beautiful and my handsome Virgos out there, of course. Uh, keep in mind that this is a gentle reading, so it's not going to resonate with every Virgo. So please take the parts that does resonate and what doesn't leave it on out. Also, this could be the past, the present, or in the future. And to be aware of any scammers in the comments that you're pretending to be me. Virgo, the first card that came out was Receipts. Somebody got some type of receipts about something, okay? They got some type of proof here, okay? Maybe somebody seen something. We do have your access granted. Maybe they seen something here, which caused somebody to have some type of a panic or get in some type of uh, scarce energy. Like, this person is scared, okay? Because somebody, whoever this person is, they're all up in their head. They, we got the eight of staffs here. I mean, the eight of uh, knives. Then we got the five of sticks and the gala jack. So, basically, whoever this person is, they're in their head. They're confused. They don't know which direction to go because somebody could have been highly competitive against you is what I'm getting here, Virgo. And this person realized that they have to sit in their discomfort and realize that you are the true deal, okay, or something like that. Like I said, they got some type of proof. For some of y'all, the bottom of the deck, um, when I was pre-shuffling in the other video, it showed that somebody was triggered by something that you may have. Somebody could have um, seen that you got a new car, place, Business is something here that triggered somebody is what I'm getting. Yeah, somebody's upset now in the present moment. All right, whoever this person is. And some of y'all, Virgo, you could be overwhelmed as well because you could be somebody here that um, definitely connects with the source. All your senses is basically tugging at you right now. You could be very uh, clairvoyant or something of that nature. Okay, and with that being said, it's like you feel things or you, you connect with source. Okay. Is what I'm getting here. And sometimes it could be overwhelming and also draining for some of y'all. But you're minding your business. Something here is... Yeah, somebody's realized something is real about you. Maybe your gifts for some of y'all. Okay, whoever this highly competitive person is. What's the, what else going on, spirit? Yeah, this is somebody that's reminiscing. Reminiscing, okay? Thinking about returning to you. Okay, yeah. Somebody feels like they need to tell you something. They're on the verge of confessing something. Okay, for some of y'all, this could be a twin flame or somebody that you're marrying at this time. Okay, we got here gossip. So maybe there's a lot of gossip or what this twin flame has been saying about you. Uh-oh, y'all. One second. Yeah, so maybe this person was gossiping about you, okay? Whoever this person is, oh my gosh. Whoever this person is, okay? See all them distractions here, Virgo? I just can't, <laughs> but yeah. This is somebody that's focused on you, okay? That's somebody that feels lost without you, okay? Somebody could have seen that you came up in some type of way, Okay, and they're upset about it. They're scared. They're in panic. Okay, because you have something. There you go, Virgo. This is somebody that's trying to look over you. Okay, we got the King of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Because I'm getting this person was being petty about you. Okay, saying petty things about you. And I'm getting this people here. Everybody's getting proof and receipts about this person lying about you. And that's what is exposing this person. Because maybe you got something new. Or maybe you got a car, house, place, whatever it may be. And it's like what they said about you was a lie. Because people are realizing that you are actually focused on your personal life. Okay, it's what I'm getting here. So the lies. What was the gossip about? Six of Cups, something from the past. Okay, we have your justice. So you're getting justice for something, okay? Your name is being cleared from something from the past. It's like people here are discussing your past. Why do people base shit off of material things, though? But anyway, somebody sees that you're committed to something, all right? They, yeah, they see that you're committed to something. Whoever this person was, they were definitely competing with you, okay? It was like, who? I'm, I'm getting somebody was like, 
who can outdo the other. Like there was a masculine competing with a woman trying to see how he can outdo her is what I'm getting. And that's so sad because whoever you are, Virgo, you was focused on yourself and not this person. Like you was not going back and forth with this individual. Like, I don't know what they had going on, honey. All right. But maybe you was off dating, it was off dating or whatever like that. But somebody was only dating to try to replace you or just one up you in some type of way. But it was like they, they attracted a whole bunch of Jezebel type of women and you attracted, you know what I'm saying, sophisticated gentlemen or what have you, okay? You know what I'm saying? People that's going to open, you know, pull out a chair for you or open a door for you or will just respect you, okay? Why this man, he got, he got, he dealing with Jezebel women. Okay, but you was looking for a commitment, and that's what you got for some of y'all, or you just taking your time. It's not a race. It's not a game for you, okay, is what I'm getting. What else, Spirit? Yeah, we got here the Seven of Wands. You are protected because you held your ground with the Strength card. You could be a Virgo Leo cusp. Okay, yeah. And it's like you took time into yourself. Okay, or you are protecting yourself and what you have created. All right, people see that. People are putting you on a pedestal and this person was trying to knock you down. Okay, you see how this person got this rope uh, around the statue trying to bring the statue down, but it's so strong it can't be, you know what I'm saying, put down. Okay, it's what I'm getting here. Yeah, Will of Fortune, you kept on going is what I'm getting and you satisfied all your needs. And the only reason why this person is trying to come back into your life or communicate with you, okay, is because they realize they cannot manipulate you back into coming in, you know, saying back around them or whatever it may be, sun energy. So some of y'all, somebody being exposed, okay, yeah, we have here star in reverse Aquarius energy. That's the truth. I'm telling you, an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, they're about to be exposed. Because people are seeing, getting proof now that, I don't know, somebody could have said that you, for example, you were lazy, you wasn't out here focused on your goals, but people are seeing something for themselves, okay, and they're realizing that this person was just competing with you, and it's like you won an invisible competition, boo, okay, for whoever you are. This is a man competing with a woman or a woman competing with a man. Put it where it fits. Yeah, this was a player energy. That shouldn't do nothing. See, they were trying to live that fast player-ass energy, okay, lifestyle. And then they get to nowhere but trapped up, babies here and there and shit like that, okay? And you do shit for this person. <laughs> but got them trapped up, trying to live that fast life. It's what I'm getting here. Yeah, Ten of Wands, this person is overburdened by all the responsibilities that they have to take care of, that they have created in their life. It's what I'm getting here. Yeah, but then sit around here trying to breadcrumb you when you had the divine love. You was the, you, I said, the gates of heaven, honey. Okay, type of love that you brought to the table is what I'm getting here. Now, now this person is obsessed with you and don't even want to let you go. Okay? Wow. They want this four of wands with you. Here you go, Queen of Pentacles, Ten of Cups. Now they want to marry you. Now they want a boy by. Okay, they look like a fool because at the end of the day, they had all these feelings for you. Okay? And but sit around here and want to dog you out and talk about you and compete with you. That's such such bitch like to me. You know? Well, we got the uh full card. This person looks like a fool. They shouldn't have been playing these foolish ass games. It's what I'm getting here, Virgo. Yeah, three of swords. Yeah, not even that's three of swords, heartbreak ass energy, because they're still lusting after you. This person can't even get it up with other women, okay? Yeah, exactly, stagnant, okay? Boy, bye. All right, yeah, we got the queen of swords and a six of wands. Yeah, you cutting this person off, honey, and ain't do nothing but lead you to success, baby, okay? And this person sitting in anxiety, thinking about you really left them, and you did, okay? And you did. Yeah. Ace of Pentacles, period. Some of y'all could definitely be dating somebody else, okay, with the Seven of Cups, lovers, and the Ace of Pentacles. For some of y'all, you are taking your love somewhere else, okay? Like I said, you do dating. You could be dating a gentleman or you're about to, okay? Period. Somebody that know how to, you know, say, will you off your feet, but in a good way, okay? Not play games or whatever like that, honey. I know that's right, okay? Yeah, you moving forward in that situation, Virgo. Here you go again. Yes, honey, somebody that's giving you your flowers and that's putting you on some type of a pedestal, okay? Period. Somebody that's going to lift you up, honey, all right? 
is what I'm getting here. Yeah. I don't know what this person thought because you got this magnetic pool. You could pull in anybody that you want, but you take your time. Okay? Period. You ain't rushing into it. Okay? You ain't got nothing to prove to nobody and you ain't no competition with no dude or no woman. Whatever. Put it where it fits. Okay? But this, this person try to act like you ain't had that pressure, honey. Please. Now they want to sit up in here and be a denial. Not face the truth. Please. Okay, I bet they know now. Stop playing with the Virgo, period. All right, Virgo season coming up. Yeah, 10 of freaking swords. Yeah, no. Okay, trying to come home all hours of the night. Okay, this person took a little bit too long to get their shit together. Yeah, world card. You're closing out this cycle. Yeah, five of cups, and they sitting in here regret over this breakup. Okay, because you're standing your ground. Yeah, this person trying to rush in now because they feel like there's competition. There's going to be a choice that needs to be made. We got the Queen of Wands and we have the Three of Pentacles. Okay, somebody realized that something could be over with the Queen of Wands and you have fire in the chart. Okay, and they're going to try to tell you, uh, come back and tell you that, oh, it, it, this is not going to work with me and so-and-so. So, woo de woo de woo that person, that, that person didn't even want them. Keep it real. Okay. You, the other person didn't even want his ass. It's what I'm getting here, Virgo. So, just know you had a man out here competing, okay, with you, trying to tell everybody this or that about you or whatever, okay? But come to find out that the proof is in the pudding, baby. The receipts is out. The receipts is out. The receipts is out. Top of energy, okay? All right now, Virgo. I'm going to go ahead and end it right there. I love you guys so freaking much. I need anything else from me, look in the description box below. If you guys want to check out more of my content, go check out my TikTok account, okay? Love you guys. See you next time. Bye.